Story time! In my old school, I was in a friend group of five girls, including me. Annie, Camila, Jenna, and Emily. We were all like best friends and always had sleepovers on Fridays or on the weekend. But Camila always said that she couldn't make it because she had soccer practice. We all said, it's okay, you'll come next time, even though she never came. And we never thought anything about it. Until one Wednesday afternoon at lunch when Emily went to the bathroom. We were all like, oh my god, we should totally throw her a slumber party for her birthday next week, Friday. And everybody said, yes, of course, and we all started planning it. But of course, Camila said, sorry, I have soccer practice, I can't make it. And me, as a straightforward person I am, said, you really can't miss one soccer practice for your best friend's birthday party? She, of course, felt really, really bad and said, okay, fine, I'll go. We were all super happy, but that was obviously a really bad idea. Part two of my last story time. So the day comes of Emily's birthday and we go to her house and we set up all the decorations, the piñata, the cake, the all the arts and crafts, all the activities and everything. And when we arrive, like we surprise her and we do all the activities, we eat cake, we do the piñata, we eat a bunch of stuff and then it starts getting pretty late. So we decide, oh my god, let's go upstairs and like watch scary movies and tell scary stories and let's bring all the candy. So we went upstairs with like all the candy, like a bunch of candy, and we all set up our like movie spot, and we start watching scary movies and telling scary stories. Everybody gets pretty tired, and we're all like, yeah, I'm going to bed, yeah, me too. But for some reason, Camila was like, no, guys, come on, let's pull an all-nighter. Everybody was pretty tired, but apparently Camila was not. Annie and Emily decide, let's try to pull an all-nighter, but everybody else went to bed. But that night, something very scary happened. I'm so Part 3 of the Camila story time. In the middle of the night, I hear a noise, so I decide to get up because I had to go to the bathroom anyways. I see that a bucket of Twizzlers were tipped over. I thought, oh, maybe someone else also had to go to the bathroom. Let me go look for them. And while I'm leaving the room, I see that Camila is the only one who's not in her sleeping bag. I go to the nearest bathroom and I check if anyone's in there, and there's no one in there. I really had to go to the bathroom, so I got inside and I did my business, and while I was doing my business, I heard a door slam. After I finished doing my business, I got up and I started looking for Camila in all the bathrooms because Emily's house is really, really big. I go look around in the other bathrooms and there's no one in them. So I decide to look in some of the bedrooms, but there was still no one in there. I decide to go back upstairs and wake up Annie, Emily, and Jenna. We all start searching the house, but we can't find Camila anywhere. This moment, we were all scared that she had gotten kidnapped. Then we go into Camila's parents' bedroom and we see that the dad isn't in his bed. Last and final part of the Camila story time. So when we went into Emily's parents' bedroom, not Camila's, sorry about the confusion on my last video, we see that Emily's dad wasn't there, and we start thinking that Emily's dad kidnapped Camila. Emily was bawling her eyes out. We were all super scared, and I had never been this scared in my entire life. Emily's dad was like a second dad to me, so I was super scared that I had been hanging around a kidnapper my entire life. Emily's mom woke up and said what's going on, and we tell her this whole story, and she's like, girls, calm down, Camila went home. We were all like, wait, what? And she was like, go get some rest, I'll tell you tomorrow at breakfast. At breakfast, Emily's dad was back. He explained to us that Camila was scared of the dark and scared of sleeping at other people's houses. And she probably dropped the bucket of Twizzlers when she was getting up to go tell Emily's parents that she wanted to go home. Camila's fine now and everything's okay. Thank you guys so much for all the love and support on my videos. Story time. So me and this girl Jessica had a lot of beef together. She would always spread rumors about how I am adopted because I don't look like the rest of my family. And that was not true. But one day, I showed up to school and everyone was just staring at me in a really mean way. It's like I murdered someone. I quickly run to my best friend and ask her what's going on. She then told me that I told Jessica that she was a spoiled brat and that I beat her behind the school. And it turns out that Jessica told the whole grade. Everyone was against me. My first two classes passed and it felt like I've been there for a year. Everyone was still staring at me and I just couldn't get anyone to believe me. But I had enough of Jessica. During lunchtime, I went up behind her and pulled her hair as hard as I could. And it turned out Jessica had fake hair. She was using a wig. That was so good. Sure. What now? 
Babe, there is a bacon. Okay. Dude, she's poor. I'm what? Poor. Like, look at you. Oh, like, I'm crying behind me screen. You are. Like, you're poor. You don't have any Robux. Okay. And you don't have a life. Bro, she is roasting you so bad. It's kind of funny. How is it funny? She is poor and broke Lamau. Bro, look at when I joined. Okay, I don't care. Says you. Shut up. Never. Bro, she is annoying. Let's go, babe. No. Ugh, why? Apologize, or I'm staying with Bacon. Bro, she is poor. Why would you stay with this loser? Because I find her nice. Well, I have one zero 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 she probably is poor and not even gonna dress nice. And she is probably asking her mommy for Robux Lamau. Back widows. Oh, okay. Asked mommy for Robux. Kenzie. W-H-A-D. That was mean. Okay. Why you sticking up for her? Kenzie. I think you should know the truth. What truth? Riley is my sis. Oh, you didn't told me that you had a sister. Well, now I did. Riley, can I talk to you in private? Yes. I'm so sorry. It's okay. Can we be friends? Yes. Yay, thank you. You are mostly welcome. Let's head back. Yes. Part 2. Yeah. Let's head back. Yes. So what did you talk about? Now we are friends. Nice. Yay. You wanna play the hood? Sure. sure. You guys said that at the same time. Yeah. Well, we kinda are twins. Well, I can kinda see that. Well, my bro likes you. Riley. Oops. Sorry. Well, yay, he is my boyfriend after all. Lol, yay. Babe. Yes. I want another kiss. Babe, didn't you have licky a lot when we kissed for two hours? Yes, but I want another own. A uh, fine. Come here. They kissed for 15 minutes. That was so good. Babe, your sis was watching us the whole time. Oh, oops. Sorry, Riley. No, it's fine. I was enjoying it. Ayo. Ayo. You what the actual hell? You was enjoying it? Yes. To be honest, bro, I should go back to my group chat. Yeah, you go have fun. Oh, yay, Riley. Yes. You forgot to add me on Roblox. Oh, sorry, Kenzie. No, no, it's fine. But don't forget this time. All right. Bye, lovebirds. Bye. Bye. So what you wanna do? To be honest, I am tired. I will talk to you in the morning, my love. Good night, love. Good morning, babe. Good morning, babe. How did you sleep? Good, what about you? I slept well. That's good. Yeah, my sis is gonna join. Yay. Hello, lovebirds. Hey. What's up, Riley? Nothing much. Just checking on my lovebirds. Oh, alright. Yep. Can I sing for you all? Oh god, why? Babe, what song is she gonna sing? She is obsessed with CPR. What the actual hell? Okay, time to sing. That was weird. That was sus. Riley, when did you learn that song? On TikTok. Oh god. TikTok is my obsession. And CPR. You don't have to tell me twice. How old is she? She is 19. Part 3. How old is she? She is 19. 19. Yes. 
Damn she older than us. Well I am not surprised. How so? Because she likes CPR. Well, any age can like that song. True. Yo guys. Yes. yes. My friends wants yo guys to join my group. Whoa, you for real sis? Yes. Who's all in there? Mike, John, Izzy, Sarah. Damn that's a lot. I used to have more. Oh. Yeah. Their names were Ben, Brittany, Jacob, Alex, Michael, Gabe, Sabrina, Veronica, Nathan, Tristan, and Sam. A lot of people. Damn. Yep. They left me for a bucks and some use me for wasting their time, I guess. Damn, that sucks. Yep. I told my bro about that a while ago because he knows a lot of my ex-friends. Oh, do you still remember their names? Some of them. Why? Oh, I want to show them how much they deserve a punch. Whoa, babe. Is that too far? It's never too far to do the right thing. For real. Okay, so... Nathan's username is Nathan Daddy One Two Three Five. What the? Don't ask. Alrighty then. Alex username is Alex Shorty. Who names themselves that? His friends, I guess. Gabe's username is Escape One Two Two. These are weird usernames. Yeah, and Sabrina username is Sasha Sabrina One Two Nine. Do these usernames? I know, I know. Okay, so. That's all the usernames I can think of since I don't remember the other usernames. Okay, thanks. You're welcome. The Bandit is one to three. Wait when? Remember. Hey. Hi. I want to tell you something. Same. You go first. Okay. I wanted to tell you thought I am using you. Bye. I was gonna tell him that he had a bro. It's okay, whatever. Oh, I'm so sorry. It's okay. At least we're good now. But UHM, can you add my other ex-friends? Sure. By the way, I never left them. Oh. Yay. Can you add them? I want art with them. All right. Alexa shot high was added. Um hi. Oh my god, Riley. Apparently you're a rich person. Alex. What? Shut up. Okay, fine. Hey, Alex. Wait. Did you talk to yourself? Bro, what was that laugh? To be honest, I really don't know. Kinda sound weird. Um, yeah. Anyways, how y'all doing? Good, bad. Why? Kinda did miss you. Kinda don't miss you. What do you mean? Since you left, I started to realize that I should think of myself, not anybody else. Oh, but you did miss me? Well, I did. That's good. Yeah. Anybody else? Good. Amazing. That's good. Yeah. So I'm going to the mall, so talk to y'all later. All right. Oop, he left. Yay. Anyways, what now? I don't know. Wanna add my other ex-friend? Yeah. So this ex-friend is gonna be strange. How so? They talk funny. Oh, that person. Yes. Okay, are you ready? Yeah, I guess. All right. Oscar wanted to was added. Oh my, who's all these people? Figure that out first. Wait, Riley. I know that Nathan boy. Nathan boy? Never mind. Anyways, who's this hottie? Which one? Oh, the one next to you. I'm her girl. Oh, girl. Girlfriend dummy. Yay, I knew that was it. <laughs> Dude, why? I had to. Yeah, seems like it. Yeah. Well, anyways, I got to go. Okay. Part 5. 